Hello, this is Johnny. We're going to test the spinner. Uh, what I did is I plug it in. You just take it straight out from the box and then just plug into PS2. But then I was looking at this paper and I was wondering why the system was moving very slow. Pre uh, it say, please unplug the spinner socket before switching dip switch. Okay, so this dip switch is uh, Oh, sorry, this is for the spinner. Look at the wrong one. Where's the paper? Here we go. Okay, this is what it looks like. Uh, you have, to, you. this is the dip switch for the color change over here. I don't have really crazy, worry about too much about the color right now. Right now it's just testing the spinner. And I noticed that you have to remove this. You plug it in here, but you have to remove the jumper. You say, uh, how to remove the D4 8 millisecond delay legacy setup for RK1 up. So if you have that, uh, it's gonna delay for eight seconds. So you have to remove the jumper. So maybe that's why this game is move is running real slow. Let me just demonstrate it real quick. So when I play this, so when I move it, it's not going. See, let me just demonstrate it. When I try to do, see, it's not moving fast enough. Even though I see, it's not moving fast. I mean, it's moving, but it's not moving. Even though I, I hit it, it doesn't move. Okay, so we're gonna open that up. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and plug it from here. All right, and let's let's take this out and see what's going on with the. Uh, why is it delaying when I when I spin the ball like super fast and it's not moving? So you have to use some kind of plastic. To dig into these little things to pick it up otherwise you're going to scratch it let's zoom it down so you can watch me doing it while I'm sitting on the table okay turn the volume down all right, with a bing, bing, bing noise irritating. This thing is not easy to open. Both exactly the same same thing on <laughs> both sides. There we go. I just have to push it, force it in. This thing, thing is not easy. Assume you got one size up, the other side should come up easy, you know. But now,
This is a lot harder than I expected. Huh, found it. Doggone stupid thing. Let's see, everything will fall apart. I <laughs> don't know how to put it back, everything fall apart. Oh crap. Seriously, is that correct? Man, I hope I didn't damage it. I'll try to put it, I'll try to put this in between here. I guess you just set it right there. This one's set over here. Man. I didn't damage it. All right, so we gotta get that pin out. Okay. So I I don't know. I never took it out, so I didn't know where that stupid thing's supposed to go. Let's see if I can use my finger. Okay. So I took those two pins that supposed to be right in the middle. Okay. So if you want to use it for all K one up, you gotta put it between those two in the middle. All right. So. So let's put this back on here between, I guess, between that. Let's see, hopefully I didn't damage it. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so we got this plug in. Okay, it's already plugged in. All right, I guess it doesn't matter how you put it in, just put it in like this. Okay, so far so good. So yeah, take that pin out. Because we're not using the delay, so we're using it for Raspberry Pi. So now you just, I guess, push it down. All right, all right. Let's test this this sucker. See, see if it if it any better. All right. Let's try again. Okay, so now that thing moved faster now. It's more like it. Ah, a bit too fast. Still not that great. I mean, it's faster than what I expected, but First time was too slow, and the second time is too fast. 
Now he suggests to buy some plastic to replace those black thing that I was just showing you, you know, the direction. But at least I didn't break it. At least it's still working. I really don't know what other game that work with this. I just random going through it. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not even putting on the showing you how I did it. All right, let me go back to that game again. I'm so sorry. I didn't even just realize that. I'm not sure this thing work with the uh, trackball or not this game. So no idea. Some of the game in this uh this image it, it doesn't work correctly or some of some of them doesn't even work. Like this one apparently did not work. So just FYI. So uh, let's try that game again. I apologize, I did not. Okay, so you can see the screen and the trackball. So let's try it. I'm 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 I noticed that. If I have that thing plugged in, I have this kind of problem with the with my Raspberry Pi. Now, once it's inside the game, I don't get this problem. So, if I unplug it, and I go into the game, So it's I'm having some kind of compatibility issue with the uh, with this thing. I mean, it was working a while ago when I was playing with it, but now it seems like it is going crazy. this one Yeah, even with that thing taken out, I have a problem with it. Do I recommend this trackball? No, I don't. I, I, I have. I mean, in arcade one, though, I have no problem. But with with this uh, retro arcade, I don't think this trackball is made for it because. It doesn't play the same way, uh, so I mean, it's supposed to be plug and play. You just plug it in and play, but apparently, I'm having some problem with the trackball. I think the only game that I play okay is uh, Centipede. Maybe Centipede and Metal, Metal P. But not. Not with uh, any kind of blocking, you know, the bar thing.
Okay, I'm using a joystick for that. Game over or what? I'm terrible with this game. Either that or my my track trackball just not. I'm trying to find a different game that I can use the trackball. Uh, let's go back to uh, let's go back to the centipede and uh, metal piece because apparently the other game I'm not that familiar with. Oh, here we go. Here's another one. All right. Try so. Huh. It's pretty good. Ah. I mean, it's nice to have a trackball that have color and play it, but I'd rather just play play it. I just rather just play it. Uh, let's let's try with the joystick. See how well it plays. Those sticks tend to be longer to get there. They still work. Ah! Hi. I'm just terrible, I guess. I don't know. I mean, to me, the spinner to me is more fun, you know, especially when you're playing with. Uh, templates but centipede I mean to me it's not necessary to track trackball maybe that's why the reason trackball went out of a population you know you don't see a joystick that come with a trackball anymore because people just don't use trackball as much as you know as much even though if a trackball work well I guess the game is kind of worth it you know the only thing I found that is fun with this is uh, Centipede. I can't find all the game that use uh, trackball. Oh, here's another one. Oh, it's kind of weird. Never seen it before.
rough. <laughs> I could deal with this one. No. Seriously? I guess it's okay. I mean, it does I just maybe I'm not good at playing this kind of game. I mean, I recommend if you have RK one up, I recommend upgrade to this trackball because it's nicer, it's smoother. Uh, I bought one from RK one up. Let me turn it down. I bought one from RK one up, and after like two months not touching it, using it, and I went back and I do this. When I do this. I didn't hear no, I don't hear that, okay? I bought, I, bought, I bought a new one and they say they improve it, they make it better. And when I first got it, you know, the first week, first month, it was, it was nice. It was like this, okay? No problem. But then after two months, uh, maybe, yeah, about two, three months later, and I went back to it and then I do this, and it doesn't do that. Uh, so... So if they tell you that go buy hey go buy me go buy the RK one up they this one is actually they're both about the same price, and so when I bought it from RK one up, I was thinking okay you know this it, the price is reasonable but then it doesn't light up you know this one you could change the color you could go to the back and change the color so you know I turn the color off okay see now it's green so. One thing I like about this is that you have color and it does work, okay? So if you have RK one up, I do recommend it. If you have Raspberry Pi, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I mean he himself say that you have to buy something to fix it, you know, the three D point out. But that is because it's too sensitive. Uh I don't know is it too sensitive or not. To me, it's um, maybe I'm just not good playing this uh, trackball because I remember when I play in RK if if I see something and I want to get it you know I'm this far away and it's coming down this way I could just go woo and then I could get it but I don't know so but if you want to add this to it it will have space you you could add that into into the into it so you could but I rather put a, a spinner in here than, than anything because uh, it played nicely especially with the templates and stuff like that and I love templates uh, trackball I'm not really that crazy about trackball maybe for centipede but the this thing normally I play with the joystick you know I don't have problem playing with joystick I can't get out this stupid game and and then this is the problem I'm finding. After I install the trackball, I have a problem getting out or, go, or going into the game with my button. I don't know if it's conflicting, address conflict, but I can't get out of the game. And so this is the problem I'm finding when I add this in. So I don't know. All right. So that's my review about the trackball. I mean, my honest opinion is is it, it work but it doesn't work 100% uh, color does change you could change to a lot of different color which is cool but it does have a conflict between the special with this image now maybe with other image it might you know it might be better now it's blue so it might be better with different image but with this image now it's a different color it, it's, it's nice you know but Wow, now it's blue. So it is pretty, it's nice. I mean, I do like it, but it does have a conflict between my image because the setup, right now my button doesn't seem to work anymore. And I don't know why it doesn't, it do not work. So, and then after playing the game, going back to the game, now the game is acting weird. 
I don't know. The only way I could get out of the game. But yeah, let it reboot it and let's try it one more time and see if that game I could uh, go back in or we could try the centipede. See if a centipede could go in and go back out. So, I don't know. But uh, templates, the spinner, I, I don't have any problem and it's been very nice. I really enjoy playing it. But mainly this this spinner is for my uh it's for my templates. And none of this thing will work on this thing because it's set up to work only on joystick. So I don't remember which game I was playing. Oh, that game looked more more complicated than anything. This game. But but I noticed that some of the game they do modify it so that it will work with joystick. So maybe that's why it's not working with the trackball, because it's really made for joystick instead of the. See, like this one do not do not work at all. You have to use a, you do have to use a joystick. So the the trackball does not do not work. See. So do not work on the trackball. I was looking for two of the games, but I don't know what they're called. Let's go find centipede. Centipede should be here. C E A. There you go, centipede. All right, let's try it with centipede again. Ah. <coughs> I press select as stars. See, even with a, even with that, it doesn't really help. I mean, centipede is just made to move around with the ball. It's not really made where you could travel across real fast. You know? So even with the fancy let up L trackball is still play the same same way. Ah oh, crap. Now maybe for the for the full size arcade we have more space over here with two player I probably could add that add this to it. You know. But I don't know why this image have an issue, so maybe I need to get the one that is made for for RK one up the image, then use this. Because this image it was nobody ever tests this image with the trackball and the spinner and, and today is the first time I doing I'm doing it. So maybe that that might be the problem. I don't know. Maybe the image issue that is not working, but it, it does function. You you do have to take the jumper pin out, and you you have to plug this cable in when you first got it. I don't think it's plugged in, and if not, you have to yeah you you still have to open it up if you're gonna use it for Raspberry Pi. If you don't, you don't have to take any pin out. You know, just play just fine. I don't know what I did with the pin. I pulled it out. I don't know where I put it. All right, thank you for watching. Hope this helped you. Uh. This is what I went into, the kind of spirit uh, problem I went into. But um, it does light up, does change color, look very pretty. The one I like the most is this one. This is the one I recommend to get if you have Raspberry Pi. This is the one I... If you if you want to play trackball, you could get it. You know, just for fun. I, I did got two of this, got two of this. And also got a cap, color. So, 
I like Glenn. I support him. But sometimes I have to tell you the way how I see it. Uh, this is what I'm. I'm. I want to plug it in. Just plug and play. That's why he for when he first this came out. He that's why he said plug and play work. You don't have to do nothing. And later on, he did a video say, yeah, you do have to buy, buy a three D printer and change this sensitivity to less sensitivity because people are complaining it. But yeah, so don't know. Uh, but I do find out some again works, some again doesn't work. So it's not hundred percent because trackball is going away because uh. People are playing more joystick. It's easier to just have a joystick that do everything. So some of the game they do modify to work with 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 joystick. It doesn't work with a trackball. So that's my uh, opinion. So if you could find old game that use a trackball, yeah, you know, use a trackball. But once you get used to it, you probably. I mean, once I get used to, it, I probably will play. You know, able to control it much better because this is my first time playing with it. So maybe that's why I'm not doing a good job playing with it and plus I don't think I'm good at playing those games I can admit that so I don't know I don't know what to tell you uh if you want to get it yes if you never have a trackball yes I do recommend getting it but uh if you if you already have one and you just want to buy it because you I don't know it's up to you <laughs> I'm right in the middle uh this one I do recommend it. I do want to get it and I and I do I was very impressed based on the game, the way you play, on the the spinner, on the templates, and the RK one up. We're using Raspberry Pi, both of them work perfect. This one worked well in because it's only a centipede. It worked well on both centipede in RK one up and in Raspberry Pi. But other game not very good. Okay, other game not that great. So that's all I could say and that's all I could tell you. Alright, thank you for watching. Bye bye.